about when I went fishing as a, as a kid with my dad. And I've gone back to some of those places now as an adult and find them significantly altered, impaired, and, and we can't fish there anymore. The Minnesota Pollution Control Agency's water management efforts are tied to the Federal Clean Water Act of 1972. Under authority of the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, the Clean Water Act requires states to assign beneficial uses to waters like swimming, fishing, drinking, and supporting aquatic life, and to develop water quality standards to protect those uses. Also to monitor and assess waters, identify waters that do not meet water quality standards, identify pollution sources and determine pollution reductions needed to achieve standards, and to develop plans for water restoration and protection activities. More recently, passage of Minnesota's Clean Water Legacy Act in 2006 and Clean Water Land and Legacy Amendment in 2008 have provided a policy framework and resources to state and local governments to accelerate efforts to monitor, assess, restore polluted waters, and protect clean waters. Uh, the opportunity that Minnesota has with the passage of the Clean Water Legacy Act and the Clean Water Legacy Amendment, um, we have an opportunity to be able to assess the waters of the state, uh, identify and, and put together strategies for protecting and improving them in the future. Uh, you know, we're the envy of uh, literally every state in the nation and uh, we have great opportunity here that we just need to make sure that we take that opportunity to protect and, and restore waters for our future generations.